This is how you hurricane prep at a dealership, huh? Car on top of car on top of car. This is how you close out a dealership for a hurricane. Hurricane is coming. Got to protect all the assets. So you put them double stack. Okay. All right. Whenever you're putting up shutters, you got all of these little screws that come out here. I made the amateur mistake of taking them all the way out. You don't have to take them all the way out. You only need to take them out just far enough to get these in. And what it is, is you get these lined up with the screw holes, but don't tighten them. Don't tighten them until you get a couple of them up because you gotta interlink them to each other. See how this one, this is one thing, and this is a separate one, but they're both, they're both screwed in here. So you got to get this, you got to get this panel and this panel up together before you tighten it. Alrighty, everybody's preparing for the hurricane. We got our shutters up here, getting ready ourselves. Even got the side ones up, just in case. It's already had one little storm last night. And they're expecting us to get hit tomorrow night and tomorrow evening. So, and hopefully, hopefully the lime tree survives. And this thing doesn't overflow. But it's got a long way to go. It's got a long way to go to get from here to here. So, I don't think that's going to happen. And got the lanai covered. Got the little cameras we have. Took those down. It's sprinkling right now, but don't expect too much more. I don't think I'm gonna worry about the pots. I think they're gonna be okay. like everybody else is still putting up there I would say two-thirds of the neighborhood has the their shutters up hurricane shutters there's a few that's still not but hopefully later today they'll have theirs up and that's it I think we're ready we shall see time shall tell I think we're ready not much cloud, not much uh, rain. A little sprinkle here and there. But there's the clouds. No wind blowing. Just eerily quiet. Day two, hurricane. Uh, just a couple wind gusts. A little bit of rain. Nothing crazy yet. See the trees blowing around a little bit. Marcy's head. Uh, here in a couple more hours. Ian, Hurricane Ian will make landfall here in a few hours. About 50 miles south of us. Got a category four. By the time it gets here, it probably will be a two. And hopefully by then, We'll be ready. Well, we're already ready, but. <clears> hey, <throat> right, can you believe this? Somebody thinks the trash people are gonna come during the hurricane and pick up their trash. Today is trash day, but. Uh, but I'm thinking they'll come and pick it up. So this is day two. This is what it looks like. Got a little rain, a little wind, blowing things around. Earlier it was a little rough. Had uh, some really strong winds, but that kind of died down for the moment. And so I'm out here with the phone taking a quick little video. 
So we'll see what happens in the next few hours when the landfall happens. Alrighty, it's picking up a little more intensity. Some sheet rain. It's quite cloudy. The wind ain't blowing real bad. The wind is slightly blowing, so not too bad yet. But the worst is yet to come. It's the September the 28th. This is about noon time. And we've got another few hours before we start getting the brunt of the hurricane. It's already a little gusty, a little wet. I'm going to try to get out here. Check it out. It's quite windy. And rainy. A few gusts of wind here and there, but not much. So we'll see what happens in a couple hours when it really gets bad. There's a lot of people who still don't have their shutters up on their houses. I hope we come through this okay and they don't have any problems. If you're in the storm, be safe. And if you're not, keep on watching. <laughs> 